Hey guys, in this guide we'll cover three different parts of Bitstamp's trade view. The order book, depth chart, and trades. You'll learn about their functionality and how to read the information they display. Let's take a look at the order book first. The order book contains currently open buy and sell orders. The green column in the center of the order book is where you can see the prices of the buy orders or bids, while the red column represents the prices of sell orders or asks. More information about the orders is displayed on the sides. The amount column shows how much cryptocurrency is included in each order. Value represents the value of each bid or ask. It is calculated by multiplying bid or ask price with the order amount. The sum columns on the sides display the sum of the order amounts sitting in the book down to that point. The changes you see happening are traders opening and closing orders in real time. When a bid and ask cover each other at the same price, the trade gets matched, executed, and removed from the order book. That covers the order book. Now let's take a look at the depth chart next to it. This is a visual representation of the order book. The green graph on the left represents all the bids in the order book, while the red graph on the right represents all the asks. At the bottom of the depth chart is the price scale. This helps us to determine how many orders are sitting in the books at a certain price. The steeper the graph at a certain point, the more orders there are concentrated at that price. At the top of the depth chart, the price of the last executed order is displayed. The number written in the bids graph is the total value of all buy orders, and the value written in the asks graph is the total value of all sell orders. If you cross the depth chart with your mouse, it shows you the total amount of crypto in bids or asks from the current price to the point where we put our mouse pointer. You can mark a desired price by clicking on the depth chart. The minus and plus icons on the side of the current price allow you to zoom in and out of the chart. If you click and hold the right mouse button, you can get a closer look of that specific part of the depth chart. Clicking on Reset Zoom will take you back to the previous view. That's about it for the depth chart. This brings us to the last part of this guide, the Trades column, which is located on the left of Bitstamp's trade view. The Trades column is where all the recently executed trades are recorded. Each row shows the details of one trade. Under Amount, we can find how much cryptocurrency was exchanged in that trade. Under Time, the exact time of recent trades is recorded. And under Price, we can see what price the orders were executed at. Just like in the order book and depth chart, green stands for buy orders and red stands for sell orders. In the upper left corner of the Trades column, you can click on the speaker icon to enable a sound notification every time an order is executed. A higher sound stands for an executed buy order, while a lower sound signifies a sell order. But let's keep that disabled for now. In the upper right corner of the Trades column, you can switch from Last Trades to My Trades. This will only display the trades you made. That's about it for our third Trade View Guide video. We've taken a close look at the Order Book, Depth Chart, and Trades column. All that's left for our final Trade View Guide is the Orders section which is the part you use to actually trade at Bitstamp. If you're looking for videos on any other part of the trade view, you'll find them on our channel as well. Subscribe to stay up to date with the latest Bitstamp news and clues.